Hello and welcome back to the Long Dark Winter Mute. In the last episode, we rescued Gwen from the airplane wreck, which is just outside the cave. We spent the night in the cave because it was starting to get dark. And I have to get Gwen back to Thompson's Crossing if I can. And the only way I'm going to, be able to do that is to carry her there. So I want, I want her to have a good day, a good night of rest before I started carrying Gwen back. Not that I've had a particularly good day of rest. But, um, sorry, good night of rest as I've had to get up several times to make sure Gwen was okay. Give her some water, make sure she's hydrated. She's 100% at the moment. So, how heavy have I? 3195. Well, I don't really want to drop anything else that I'm carrying with me. I could probably drop one of these, actually. I need two of them. Got three hours left on my campfire. It's still relatively early morning. What's the temperature like out? Oh, minus 15. Hmm, might have to leave it an hour or two before we depart, I think. There's any wood around that I can grab easily. cases. Have to be quick. Gotta get back to Gwen soon. It is pretty cold around here at the moment. Right, okay, so not much this way. I think we're gonna have to go back the way we came. Yeah, it's cold out here. Right, let's get back to the uh, cave. Might grab some more wood on the way back. Just in case we have to stay here a bit longer. Alright, let's get back. How are we doing, Gwen? Didn't mean to drink that, I meant to pick it up, but there you go. How are you doing? You're still 100% good. Uh, right, let's drop some of this wood first of all. Well, get this water melted. Okay, Gwen, let's go. I've got you. Weather. I think it will kill Gwen. So let's go and put her back down and get some more firewood. We may have to spend another day here. 
Oh, I know this sticks around it, but I was hoping for something a bit more substantial than that. Aha! Yeah, see how cold we get. We, I think it'll be end of Gwen if we went back in this weather. It's so cold. I just want to lay down for a bit. Yeah, I'm numb. Day or two, I think. Let's have some banged up pork and beans, shall we? Not yet, Astrid, not yet. Maybe I can't chop one of these trees up. Wood is what I want. You'll do. up whilst I'm here, put it in the cave, you know where it is then. Don't want that, don't want that. Well the book might be useful. Starting fires. Oh, I can't see more wood here so let's get this branch. Minus nine. Warmth has been all day, but it's mid-afternoon. Mm, it's going to be a risk if we go back. How are you doing, Gwen? You're still at 100%. Do I need to administer anything to you? Easy. Just going to see if I can help. Water, yes. I've done what I can. That's nice, Astrid. Right. Let's see what's wrong here. Get some rest now. You need it. Yes, I think uh, that's probably a good advice, Astrid, to get some rest. Mm -hmm. I will produce just one more water and then I think I'll be turning in for the night. Fire is... I've got a few more sticks. Got roughly 10 hours, so we should hopefully get through to daylight. In the meantime, I should really eat and drink.
Let me have a look, okay? Right, I'm going to turn in and I'll see you in the morning. Well, I've spent the night here with Gwen. Does she need any water? Let's see what's wrong here. Sleeping for a couple of hours, waking up, giving her water, making sure she's comfortable, etc. And got about an hour left on the fire, so what's the temperature like outside? Oh, it looks a nice day. Cold. Minus 14. Clouds are scudding across the sky really fast. Looks like it could be a nice day. Minus 27. I'm going to keep my mouth shut. Any more firewood come down during the night? Uh, I've done some scouting about previously and it looks like we cannot go back the way of the plane wreckage. It looks like we're going to have to go this way so there's got to be a way down here somewhere so I think I found it but as soon as the weather picks up we will exploit that finding of mine. I'm rambling, I know. I'm running out of words. Speaking is not easy today. Not while well doing something else anyway. Yes, yeah, so we're getting cold when you're straight out. Apparently got 58 minutes left on that. I've got nine sticks. A couple of hours left now. I what I might do actually. Put my bedroll down and sleep for an hour. Doesn't like it now. Please be better. Minus 13 and it's quite early on so I'm going to make a move. I know it's cold. Just hope. I just hope Gwen can be okay. Do I leave it another hour? Drink some drink. I'll drink another one. I'll quench my thirst. I keep the water for her. And it'll light my load slightly. Anything else I can leave behind. I'm going to make a move. Make sure she's okay. Easy. Give her some water, Just perhaps. See if I can help. Yeah, give her some water. Get some rest now. You need it. Sorry, I'm gonna pick you up. Up we go. Right, Gwen. I hope this is right. Just hold on. hardly made any time. We've only just left. I'm going to have to come back this way for the church artifacts. So I'll search most of these cases then. I think. Pick up the airplane food. We know where it is now. Bit of a journey, but we know where it is. Well, I have to cross this. We can make it. Yes, we can. Oh. 
Minus nine, it's getting warmer. Hopefully as the day goes on it will get warmer. It's not even near midday yet. I really hope I don't run into anything. Hang in there. A wolf. Can do this. Wolves. Bear. We're making good time. We're not far now. Easy, <coughs> easy. Hello? Me again. What? How, how did you know I was here? Party line's a funny thing. All the calls go to every phone in the area. All I have to do is wait for you to pick up. Um, what do you want, Molly? I'm, I'm kind of busy. Yeah, I saw you found a survivor at the crash site. You spying on me? Just watching. Curious. Hey, that's kind of creepy. You want to tell me what happened to your man? I don't really have time for this right now, Molly. I'll go first. You asked about my husband when we were in the house. Not much to tell, really. He's dead. I'm alive. Sorry if this sounds harsh, but you don't seem too broken up about it. I'm not. I assume he's the one in the basement. Did you kill him? and help someone the same as killing them. I guess that depends on the circumstances and the intent. <laughs> now you sound like a lawyer. Did you kill him? The wolves killed him. But my intent was for him to die. Hmm. Molly? Why are you spying on me? Makes me does make me a bit creep out, right? Where are we? There's a fire barrel here, there's plenty of wood. There's crows flying over there. We're down here. Follow the river round, I presume then. That would be the best bet, I reckon. Temperature? Minus eight. Let's get going. Give us some water first. Let me have a look, okay? Doesn't need any good. I have to carry you. Cattails there. More cattails here. Suitcase or something on the ice. Well, I'm not going to do that. Let's, let's concentrate on getting not um, Gwen back on the said Molly then. That's wood. Yes, it's wood. This looks like a cadaver, a carcass of somebody. Do I try and cut across here? Past the outbuildings? Follow the river around a bit more and cut across there. That might be better. No, I'm not complacent, Molly. Uh, Gwen. Finish it. I don't like the change in that music. Oh shoot, wolves. Hang in there. We can do this. I just have to put you down. <laughs> Is 
Sorry, go ahead. Whew. No way around this. Let's get out of here. I'm going across this way. Don't give up. I won't leave you. Well, at least I scared them off. I didn't shoot anybody or anything. It's just a suitcase. Oh, Minus well, eleven. Perhaps I could have made it the first day then. Good view of the farm here. I won't do it, don't worry. Just make sure I'm going in the right direction. Yes, I am. We're making good time. I can't feel. Getting cold now. Might be a good idea to use the valley, uh, valley buildings oh, for an hour. Warm up. Oh, she's. I can't go any faster. Will we make it? <laughs> hold on. Just hold on. Find out next week. This is going to be such a close thing. Almost there, Gwen. Just hang on. Just hang on. We're almost there. I'm getting some inside here. Get warm. you behind just want to get this fire going and I'm going to use an accelerant I don't care we need to get this going quick cool add all the firewood I've got this might be serious Pity I can't put any clothes on her. Can I put coal on yet? I can't. Cool. Got three hours. Let's do some water.
Oh, I forgot the water. Hopefully that will give us enough time to get your temperature back up so we can make it the rest of the way. Can I move you? No, I can't. Can I put you on my bedroll? Up now. Easy. Don't there worry. you go. Hopefully you'll warm up a bit quicker though. Give you some water. Hmm. I'll see if I can help. I've done what I can. Right, it's just midday. How far is Thompson crossing? It's not that far. I can give it an hour and I reckon we can chance it. Meantime, what's my hunger and thirst like? Oh, so so. Oh, that should keep me going for a bit. Well, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. We will see if we can get Gwen back to Thompson's Crossing in the next episode. But for now, thanks for watching. Do take care. See you soon.